Well, that's not your best feature, Gimli. <laughs> Someone's a little camera shy. <laughs> you can't be camera shy around here. We're YouTubers. All right, put him, can you, can you climb over and... <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, so we're gonna keep him in this blocked off corner for a little while to see how things go. We'll take George and him and do some bonding time sometime today, but we have to go in and drink our coffee and eat or whatever and um, feed the dogs. So we don't, we're not gonna be out here to keep a close eye. So this hog panel will keep him safe and he's got water and he's got some grass to graze on and um, we'll come out and see how they're doing and we'll be able to watch them through the, the kitchen door to see how they're doing. Hi Gracie, why are you rubbing up against my leg? <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's okay Gracie. Um, George, that's my boots. <laughs> well, she's not being too bad. Like, like last night, she was nipping even through. Oh, but she still wants a piece of him. He's such a pretty color. Yeah. Oh, see, she tried to nip him through. Don't put your nose close to that. You need to bit off. I don't know if you want to do that. Gracie. Oh, Gracie. Animal world can be cruel sometimes. There's a hierarchy, pecking order. Come on, Boots! Boots, 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 boots! Come on, little darlings! They coming? So excited about Gimli, I totally forgot about the chickens. So coffee's waiting. <laughs> oh my goodness. So I started um, for my chickens fermenting some feed and uh, so it's just some uh, scratch and some uh, ACV. Um, I have some crushed pepper, red pepper flakes in the mix and um, I fill it up because it's in the house and we're air conditioned right now and so I do add some 
uh, warm water and um, they are they're they free range so they're getting a lot of protein elsewhere bugs and worms and stuff like that so I'll show you how much they love it Tablespoon of MCT oil. Tablespoon of Kerrygold grass fed butter. We don't have the chocolate, but I love the chocolate. So we're putting a teaspoon of raw cacao. And about a, two splashes of heavy whipping cream.
Look at that magic right there. Yum! It's magic, you know. <laughs> oh, goodness. Good stuff. Love my keto coffee. Fat coffee. Bulletproof coffee, whatever you want to call it. Gotta feed the dogs now. Hey, Jasmine, come on. Let him eat, you eat yours. Come on, buddy. There you go, green beans. Okay, so I have little Emily and I have George in this cornered off area. Now George has kind of um, nudged him in the butt, but not not too bad. Um, he went over to where George is now, and Gracie kind of um, bit him through the fence, but not. I don't think she she didn't draw blood or anything. She just nipped his ear a little bit. So, little by little, just trying to get them all accustomed to one another. Um, been told to just let them go at it, but I'm such a noob, I'm afraid to do that. <laughs> so. been laying over in this corner so much. He feels sad. Just had to run off a dog in our yard. Um, dog that is supposedly afraid of everything, um, but was chasing the chickens. Luckily I was out here and um, got my kids out here and they chased it off. Um, so, now I'm sitting over by the pigs again, and um, watching the getting to know you session. I got company. He loves that part of his neck. Scratched. <laughs> so, just gonna bring out the camera every so often and update. That's so sweet. Okay, so the boys are getting comfortable with each other. See, we've had George on the right since the middle of June, and it's the beginning of August. So, 
and Gimli is not, he's over eight weeks, um, not quite nine weeks old, but close. And um, so they're just a couple months apart in age. Where Gracie is nine months old, so she's quite dominant right now. Oh, that's so cute. to miss each other. We just had a little bit of a dominance fight with between um, George and Gimli, but it wasn't it wasn't too bad. It was more noise and pushing more than anything. Um, he never made contact, biting, or anything. And now he's over by him lonesome again. I hate when they poop on this thing. Yeah, it's almost like... <laughs> <laughs> Crazy things. <clears throat> Even if they slip, they do some kind of weird twist and they can still kill me. Look at them. Parkour! Parkour! <laughs> what? <laughs> you failed the attempt. She's like, I'm just gonna stay here. This is safe. She's scratching. <laughs> I got so many people at work that are like, oh, I'm so jealous. I wish we had to get. Goats, like, goats, dude. Hold your That's tongue. Not worse. <laughs> I love them, but they're the worst out of our animals. You know? Yeah. They're just rambunctious. They will not be denied attention. That's the thing. They're the best. They're, well, they're the funniest. But. Woo! <laughs> You know what? I think because we moved it, it's almost like they think it's new again. <laughs> well, I think we've turned a corner. Oh my gosh, you know We've got everybody grazing. Dogs running around, goats acting crazy. And all the humans minus one. Uh oh. <gasps> oh! I spoke too soon. I just chomped him on the ear. She wanted what he had. Well, she got it. Gosh, we've been a good 15 minutes and nothing's going on. More, more pig poop. More pig poop. We got more here and there. It's who happens, especially on a homestead. How's his ear? Okay, I'll be Damn. nice. Be nice. He goes on his butt too, dude. Or you'll be getting more of the same. <sighs>